The Three Little Pigs. Once upon a time, there were three little pigs. You look friendly. Hello. I hope you like our story. Welcome. Do you like my plant? Are you ready? The time came for the little pigs to leave their home and make their way in the world. Goodbye, my little ones. Be happy, but beware of the big bad wolf. Can't we just stay? I just don't feel like going. Wow, what fun! Nice to get a bit of peace and quiet. But I've just finished decorating Shh, my don't room. Don't tell them I'm here. The three little pigs went on their way. I'm getting all dirty. This is exciting. I wish we could have a rest. How much further? I'm tired already. I wish we could have a rest. The first little pig soon found a piece of land, and he quickly built himself a house made of straw. Oh. This is easy. Oh. I hope I don't have hay fever. Oh. All done. The second little pig found a piece of land, and she built herself a house made of sticks. Ooh. <laughs> That's a good start. Ooh. La la la, I'll have this ready soon. That'll do. What a pretty house I have. <sighs> That'll do. The third little pig decided to build a house made of bricks. He worked hard. And his house took a long time to build. Oh, these bricks are really heavy. How do you do? <clears throat> I'm going to need some more cement. It's a nice day. <clears throat> that was hard work, but it's a great house. The three little pigs lived happily in their three little houses. I could dance all day. Phew, I'm tired. Now where have I put my hammer? Until a big bad wolf arrived in the neighborhood. A wolf in the van, oh no. I wonder where I should stop for lunch. The wolf knocked at the door of the first little pig. Little pig, little pig, may I come in? Not by the hair on my chinny-chin-chin. Chin. There. 
Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he blew the house down. And the little pig ran squealing to his sister's house, with the wolf racing after him. <sighs> I'm puffed. I'm getting very hungry. The wolf knocked at the door of the second little pig. Little pig, little pig, may I come in? Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he blew the house down. <gasps> After all that work. What can we do now? <gasps> and the little pigs ran squealing to their brother's house with the wolf racing after them. Getting closer. Mmm, I'm looking forward to my lunch. The wolf knocked at the door of the third little pig. Little pig, little pig, may I come in? Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff. And I'll blow your house down. So the wolf huffed and puffed, and he huffed and he puffed. But the brick house didn't fall down. <gasps> to the roof and squashed himself into the chimney. I'm really hungry now. Listen to his big feet. He's getting higher. I'll eat all three of you. When the third little pig heard the wolf's big feet on the roof, he boiled a big pot of water. Let's get this water nice and hot. Are you sure this will work? Careful, that's hot. Just as the wolf was sliding down into the fireplace, 
The little pig pulled the lid off the pot. In dropped the wolf. him a lesson. Poor old Wolfie. That wolf didn't scare me. Take that! Ha ha ha! He burned his bottom very badly and ran howling down the road. I'll be back! And the three little pigs lived happily ever after. Possible to me. I'll make lunch in five minutes. I wonder if they'll let me stay here with them. This is fun. <laughs> <laughs> 